And the House of Representatives had a committee probing all the oil prospecting licenses and oil mining leases granted by the federal government says it is looking into a revenue collection gap of $1.75 billion. The chairman of the Arctic Committee, Representative Gideon Guani, told journalists in Abuja that during the course of the investigation, the committee discovered a lot of anomalies in the process of awarding oil blocks to international oil companies by government. Another shocking revelation are non-payments, partial or staggered payments of statutory fees, such as application fees, signature bonuses, royalties, rents, renewal and relinquishment fees, as well as such other fees. And even evidences of the fees claimed to have been paid cannot be traced to the accounts where they were lodged in order to confirm if same have actually been received by the government. Efforts by the committee to ascertain these payments from the relevant government agencies, especially the Central Bank of Nigeria and the Accountant General of the Federation, have not yielded any desired result as nothing has been submitted to the committee as at the time of this press conference.